welcome to visualizing science and tech youtube channel and in this video i will show how can you color old black and white videos using ai this is the first time that i am uploading a video in my channel which is based on ai now this ai model uses no gan training and gn stands for general adversarial networking which is often used in artificial intelligence projects so let's proceed first search for an old black and white video like i have selected this one and you should copy its link then search for the ai model which is deoldify this tool is based on deep learning scroll down and under the table of contents section you will find that easiest approach this is the easiest approach because it will work in google collab and google collab is a cloud based system so you don't have to think whether your local system can actually run the program or not then it is automatically connecting for the first time when you will use it please sign in with your google account and just click on this connect button or you can click on this connect to a hosted runtime. time both will work and it will connect to google's own cloud system so you can see that it is connected to google compute engine backend and it is currently giving me 12.69 gb of ram and 78.19 gb of disk space so scroll downwards and run the cell one by one and wait till it gets finished after it gets finished a uh, green tick marks shows so in this way run all the elements Now start this setup one. This one is installing several things, but it will not take space of your local system because it is working on this. Google Compute Backend and it is finished after 11 seconds so run the next one then this one the model is based on python and it is an using ipython console so you can see that the extension of this file is .ipynb it is like the jupyter notebook there you can see the status and the estimated time remainings This is also finished. Now this is the final one. Now scroll downwards. And here is the URL. So the URL you have copied earlier, you have to paste it in this section. And this is the render factor it is set to 21 by default you can change it but here 
In the instruction set, it is written that the default value of 21 has been carefully chosen. So you should let it as it is. And then run this. So in this way, it will work and it will take many time in fact it can take hours if you have chosen a very big video so I have to edit this part and skip those parts where it will just work So after skipping few parts of the video, I am showing you how it is working. So in this case, it shows that it requires 21 more minutes and the, in this way it is converting the video. It usually takes a lot of time because every video has a minimum of 25 or 30 FPS. That means every second requires 25 to 30 minimum that amount of pictures and this file will colorize each and every pixels in that picture so you can multiply and can get an idea that it will take a lot of time now after the file has finished converting the resultant video is shown here Now you can't expect to get a vivid HD quality colorization because in those days cameras were not of that quality. Now if you want to download this video, you have to go to this these files, then go to this DLDFI and then video result and this video mp4 from here you can download the file there is also an option to download the video with no audio option so it is up to you that which one you will download So this is the colored video and the actual video looks like this. So I hope that you like this video, please subscribe to my channel.